All the mad man them have cared and some on the hot girl now on the card. Boss them have draw them money there. Bum. Ah. YTO family wanna deal with on a Tuesday. Yeah. Blessed Tuesday to each and everybody tuning into this vlog. Me know say from what you wanna say, yo, how me not hear nothing from Yardy TV. Me only I see my post video, but me not hear him voice. We day I see him here, man. You know the World Cup, we did caught up in the World Cup, and me did have some private issue with me have to deal with as well. But we there, we not gone nowhere. We always there, always and forever. So, before we head on into the video though, people, Kada One here is a video compilation we're going to do today. And before we head into the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you haven't as yet. Hit the post notification bell so that's every time we upload, you get the freshest news. So in this one now, people, we are going to play some series of videos as we stated. And the first one we're going to play is a video with Prime Minister Andrew Olness, aka Brogad, and his message that he might go tell to the criminals them when them get captured guns. So take a look, here we go. On. So all of those little boys running around with guns who believe that show them will go in front of a judge and they will plead a case and they will go through some bargaining process and they get six months and come out. Rubbish! What them say? Radam! <laughs> You're going to get 15 years minimum. Radam. So now here with the PMC people, 15 years minimum for anybody will get catch with any type of illegal pie pie, whether it's big or it's small. I think this are the same law them they are trying to implement a couple months or a couple of years now. It finally get implemented, I guess. And let me know what you think about the one of the people. Leave your thoughts in the comment section as we proceed now to the next video. So in this next video, I'm going to play now, peeps. This incident occurred in Maypen, Clarendon. And it involves a police officer and an igla. I'm not going to tell you exactly what took place in the video because I don't want to spoil it. However, in this video, there is no audio so I don't have to go pay attention to the screen. So take a look and see what I'm going. Maypen Metro Police get licked down with Bigston for taking away Higla goods. Why people are want to look to me like the people them just sick and tired of this police man yeah. Like them frustrated with him. Cause word on the street is that this officer is the officer who is always going around taking away the people them goods. So the people them look like them sick and tired of him and just give him a big stone and make him have it. Radam, like what the prime minister say. You see me I say? But me know not think people if that was too extreme or if it was justified. Leave your thoughts in the comment section as we proceed now to the next video. So this one now people, you know I'm going away yet because this video here are one of the most disgusting room I've ever seen in my life. So apparently the person behind the camera are videotape a local room. You know them room they were attached to a bar? Yes, it is one of them scenario there. The bartender live in the local room and the owner gave the room to the bartender you know if he just live there and be on time for work and all of the above but the condition how the bartender keep people in place are one of the most nastiest disgusting something ever see John up on food bed dirty and full of stain food fling down all over the place dirty clothes all over the place people me go play the video take a look see what i go on and then me give you my two piece at the end you see this sitting in me, I wonder why not. Yeah, know? this is the bartender room where she's staying, alright? Every time bartender says they want nice accommodation, give her a king size bed, you know, with fun 
and TV. Alright. This are the condition of the bartender of the room. Man. Look here, she do five, five days at the bar. Five days so far she do at the bar, right? One, two, three, the next one is to make five. Look at this one. I'll junjo. Junjo in this. Right? And every night the bartender, I yes, so she sleep. See all our cup soup there? Yes, so she sleep, right? This is it. Alright. Yeah. This now is really shocking. This a tree buckler piss this. The bathroom is right here in the building. And this a tree buckler piss. Yeah, she pissing at this at night time. She not get up, go out use the bathroom. She just pissing at tree buckler like she a prisoner. You know, and the rest of stuff them, them really disturbing. So, I don't even want to put it on the video. You understand, but this is the current situation right now of a bartender. Nice young girl, 20 year old. She don't look bad. Yeah, any man that see her and take her up and say yes, you know. Living like a prisoner. The place stink, really, really stink. Whoever that bartender is, is a nasty, disgusting, filthy, worthless woman. And me say it with a straight face. That this maddie they don't forget no room, no way bridging. That this maddie forgot to live on and eat one bridge. Damn nasty man. Y'all are pissing a buckle and all them something there. How nasty can you be? And according to the man, he must say the woman only did it for five days. So can you imagine if a woman he did it for longer? Nastiness at its highest peak. Let me know what you think about that one, your people. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't as yet. Hit the post notification bell. And also, don't forget to join the Telegram group. A link will be left in the description of this video. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and TikTok. Big up on yourself, people. Until next time, I mean, same one, Yardi from Yardi TV. We out. Cross. Hey, yo, yellow.